Both sides, that's not really going to do, um, do me any help in this example. Um, but if we're going to be taking the chain rule, derivative of uh, cosine is going to be negative sine of our inside function, ln of 4x cubed, times the derivative of our inside function, so again, which is u prime over u. So u prime in this case is going to be 12x squared over 4x cubed. This would probably be an example if you had something like this where they'd probably expect for you guys to simplify this. Um, so notice here we have y prime equals negative sine of ln 4x cubed. And then let's simplify this. 12 over, uh, 12 over 4 is going to be 3. x squared divided by x is going to be uh, x to the first power. So you could rewrite it as a negative power, or we could just rewrite it like this. y prime equals negative 3 sine of ln of 4x cubed all over x. Yes? Can you explain why you uh, did like that rather than using the product rule? Because there's no product. It's not cosine times ln. Remember the cosine function. So think about how you say cosine. Okay. Say this out loud. <laughs> yes, good. <laughs> cosine. Say that, please. Say that again one more time. OK, stop. Now say this. Say it again. Good. OK. Um, does anybody notice what he, do you anybody notice with the one word? It's of. You taking of, like, for instance, this makes no sense. Hey, what is this answer? I have no idea. Like, there's what? You're taking the square root of something. Cosine is the same thing. You're taking the cosine of something. That's exactly what we're doing. You're taking the cosine of this. So it's not multiplication, right? Cosine in and by itself makes no sense. If you're taking the cosine of something, it makes sense. Make sense? OK. Yes. You got another one? Yeah. All right. Um, this will be the last one unless anybody else has one that they want.